Okay guys, we have a cool and fun video. Let's get nerdy. Raise your hand if you're a Firebird fan, because this is a video I was like, I gotta make this while all these Firebirds are here, because I have three Firebirds right now, and um, we gotta make this video. We're gonna compare them all. So we've got three different ones we're gonna be looking at. This video is sponsored by Sweetwater, so if you would do me a huge favor, check the links down below in the description for my rig, the guitars we're using, all that stuff. I would truly, truly appreciate that. And it let Sweetwater know that we should keep keep making these videos, keep doing all the giveaways and all that stuff. So here's what we're doing. We are gonna compare through a real amp. I've heard the cries, you guys are like, compare through a real amp. We're gonna be using this Marshall Origin into the two notes. Now, the three Firebirds we have here are this one, which is a Murphy Lab 63. So essentially, we could kind of view that as being the custom shop. So this is the highest end Firebird that we're gonna look at today. I do not have a real, you know, 65 or anything like that for us, unfortunately. Now, the most affordable one that we're gonna be looking at is this Epiphone Firebird, which is incredible. Now, at the time of you seeing this video, I, don't, I no longer have this guitar. We are actually giving, or I guess by this point, we have given the guitar away, so I won't have it, but I'm like, while it's here, I gotta make this video. So we're gonna compare it to that one, and then kind of the middle of those two, is this, which is my 2019 Firebird Gibson, like standard Firebird, what do you wanna call it? But I'm selling this one, and again, by the time this video comes out, this guitar is more than likely gone. So I don't have any of these Firebirds other than the Murphy Lab one, which is what I was you know, selling all those guitars for, and I finally got it. So let's cut the chit chat. We are gonna hear the bridge, middle position, and neck pickup on all of this stuff through a lightly distorted amp, the Marshall, and uh, I wanted to know what you guys think. Do you think that they all sound drastically different? Because the pickups are different. Their overall configuration of the guitars is very similar. So let's get into it. <laughs> So for me, I mean, I know that it's, I'm biased because this, this, is, <laughs> this is like my, my guitar, but I thought this thing just sounded alive. You know, I love the, the fullness and richness of the tone. It still had a lot of twang to it, but the one that really, it just continually surprises me is this Epiphone. I cannot tell you how surprised by the Epiphone I am. I, I said it in that video, it's the best like value guitar I think I've ever played. So if, if they even have any of these Firebirds left, which last time I looked, they were sold out again. 
um, if, you're, if you're looking for that Firebird vibe, get one of those. So on that note, let me know what you guys thought. Which one was your favorite? Which one did you think uh, just was, you know, a little bit of a cut above? And thank you again to Sweetwater for sponsoring today's video. I really do appreciate that. Check those links down below. Get your rock and roll on. And then, uh, yo, I'm gonna plug in and we're gonna end it bluesy, Firebird style. Real nice and loud, but I only got camera mic audio. Oh, there it is. That middle position is the Firebird sound though, isn't it? Oh, hold on, let me hit a little, little vibrola. Bye guys. Woo!